the president of Columbia University, is very, very worried about the students. She's worried about students. Not about Jewish students at Columbia that are fearing for their life. Not about Jewish students in Columbia who are being harassed, marginalized, and attacked. No, no. She's worried about Arab, Muslim, and Palestinian students who are being named, who are being identified for their pro-Hamas, pro-violence, pro-genocidal views. Here's what she writes. President of Columbia University. If you send your kid to Columbia University, take them out. If you write a check to Columbia University, stop. She writes, the deliberate harassment and targeting of members of our community by doxing, a dangerous form of intimidation is unacceptable. Doxing here means naming names. You support Hamas? What are you embarrassed by? What are you afraid of? Why shouldn't your name be out there? Why do you hide behind a pseudoname? I don't. Why do you hide behind a mask? She writes, many individuals, including students across several schools, have been subject to these attacks by third parties. Well, they've lost their jobs. Some of them, good for the law firms, who've insisted on not hiring genocidal maniacs. You'd think that most companies in the U.S. wouldn't want to hire them if they knew. But no, Columbia University wants to hide their identity so that they can be hired in spite of their homicidal views. This includes disturbing incidents in which trucks have circled the Columbia campus displaying and publicizing the names and photos of Arab, Muslim, and Palestinian students. We are grateful, grateful for the persistence and perseverance of the students and their families in the face of this harassment. We are assembling available resources to support them and the staff and faculty who are on their, by their side. To streamline support for the members of our community who are targets of doxing, Columbia and Bernard together are establishing a doxing resource group composed of key officers across both campus, campuses and are focused on the issue. This group will serve as a centralized point of contact on the issues related to doxing, harassment, and online security. Tell with the Jewish students. I don't know if you saw the video of the Columbia, Jewish Columbia student basically crying into the microphone about how she's, how, how fearful she is to be on the Columbia campus these days. Our vice president, the president of Columbia University, all very, very concerned about Muslims in America. The Jews, not so much.